Today I wanna to share with you a story that when I read it, totally changed my outlook on what I thought success was and what it looked like for me. So there was a businessman on the beach when he saw this fisherman come up on the, on the shore with all of this beautiful fat fish. <laughs> and the businessman was like, wow, how long did it take you to catch all that fish? And the fisherman says, oh, just a couple of hours. And he said, well, why don't you stay out longer? What are you gonna do with the rest of your day? And he said, well, you know, this is enough fish for my family and I for the rest of the day and, you know, for a couple days. And I'm gonna go home, enjoy time with my family, have an afternoon nap, and then this evening, spend a lot of time with my friends and just relax. And the businessman is, oh my gosh, you need to get a bigger boat, you need to go fish longer, you need to catch more fish, and I can help you start your own enterprise. And the fisherman says, okay, so what happens when I get a bigger boat and catch more fish? And he said, oh, then you can sell it and then you can get a big warehouse and a big distribution center and you can go out and you can get more boats and you can fish all day and you know after 20 years you can build this massive empire of fish and then the fisherman was like okay so then what happens after I get this massive empire of fish and he said well then you can retire and then spend your days leisurely with your family and the fisherman is like well, that's what I'm doing now. I don't want to build an empire. I don't want to work 60 to 80 hours a week building this empire. I, I'm good with just catching enough for today and tomorrow, relaxing with my family and just doing that. One of the biggest types of mental clutter that we have is thinking that we have to do more and be more and spend more. When in reality, your version of success oftentimes looks very different than somebody else's version of success. So today, give yourself permission to think about what does success mean to you? What does it feel like to you? What feels in alignment? What feels good? If building that empire feels good, go for it. But if having the small fishing boat and just getting enough Perfect. Do what feels in alignment for you, but give yourself permission to question your version of success and see if it's really your version of success or somebody else's version that you held on to as your own. I hope this serves you today. Like and follow for more.